Hey, it's Sophia Bush, and you are watching MarieClaire.com. I think people are always surprised uh, when they find out that actresses can read. So, you know, I suppose that my, my voracious reading appetite would, would be something. Some of my favorite women, like Lee, Florence and the Machine, I mean, God, Florence Welch is such a force to be reckoned with, and obviously so is Lady Gaga. Uh, I think that Rihanna is a badass. It's been great to see Mumford and Sons get huge this year, because a year ago nobody knew who they were, except for what seemed like five of my friends. I can't go to bed unless I've let the dogs out and checked CNN one last time. Javier Bardem, probably. I think he's pretty much the greatest. And I think that him and Penelope Cruz and their little baby, I just, I can't get enough of them. I think they're so wonderful. I kind of have a crush on the both of them, and I think it's only gotten bigger now that they're a unit. One word, one word, one word, so much pressure. Clearly I don't do well under pressure, I stress out. Um, I'd say eclectic. I've never jumped out of a plane without an instructor attached to me. I'd like to, I'd like to skydive all by my lonesome. Savory. <laughs> I still can't stop talking about Half the Sky by Nick Kristoff. I just read it for the second time because it's such a powerhouse and there's so much information in it. And, and I think particularly as a woman, it's a book that every woman should read. I really like to have dinner with Nelson Mandela, just to hear his perspective for a night. I don't think I would talk, I would just say, go, <laughs> and listen. Redneck Woman by Gretchen Wilson. <laughs> Not what you expected at all, unless it's something by Jay-Z, but I like to shock people with country music.